This is the eye model. This makes up the fibrous tunic of the eye, the outer layer. If you think of the eye as an onion, each tunic is a layer of the onion. So this portion of the fibrous tunic is called the sclera. This is the cornea. And this is the limbus, where the two meet. Vascular tunic, it's one layer further in. Next layer of the onion contains the choroid. It's also where you find the ciliary bodies. Ciliary bodies contain the ciliary process and the ciliary muscle. Ciliary process is producing aqueous humor. Ciliary muscle is helping focus. Much easier to see on the bigger models. There's the iris of the eye and the pupil. The pupil is just a hole. Next layer in is the neural tunic or retina. On this model, this is the only retina that you can see. On most other models, the retina will be the entire inside of the eye. With these other models, you can see the optic disc, which is where the optic nerve leaves the eye. There's the macula lutea with the fovea centralis in the middle of it. This model also has a macula lutea, but no fovea centralis. Aura serrata is this structure here. Vitreous humor is the gel filled posterior portion of the eye. If we remove the vitreous humor, we can see where the lens is. These chambers both contain aqueous humor. They are in front of the lens. The anterior chamber is on the front of the iris. The posterior chamber is behind the iris. Both anterior chamber and posterior chamber are part of the anterior cavity containing aqueous humor. Posterior cavity contains vitreous humor. <laughs>